AI has the ability to not just find the needle in the haystack, but also help operations learn from the past. When we work with clients, we try to make the insights as relevant and as actionable as they can be for a process or industrial engineer to ingest. All of that is necessary for making this project successful and, and impactful. What drives time to value A? How much energy can I save? The second thing is how much effort it takes me to get there. So these questions should be considered and then prioritize the use case with a ratio, hey, that's the value I can get, but this is how much effort it takes me to get there. Data is really the backbone. That's the most important part. Our approach is that we have a very interactive platform. So the customer gets a lot of reward because they can click around and explore their own data and find things that they've never seen before or come up with things that they haven't thought about before. There's a couple of very important legislations, at least here in Europe. So these are really driving forces behind the need for traditional industries to adapt and drive rapid change in how they consume energy, how they consume resources. The reason for this legislation is really that the EU governments want to make industry more sustainable. So industrial companies have to show how they plan to save energy and become more sustainable in the future. That's really where innovative approaches like energy cost optimization become really relevant. SaaS is really doing both. We are helping customers to report on their current ESG status, but we also help them in creating a roadmap how to become more sustainable in the future. So we help them to save energy where they haven't done it beforehand. It's an important topic it will become even more important in the future. It's not about the, only about the cost, it's about the pressure from government, from society, whatever. We need to change and it's a good way uh, to change things faster.